Welcome to Huawei Connect Live, a tech talk. My name is Edwin Diender. I am Chief Innovation Officer in the Electric Power Digitalization Business Unit, and I am very honored to have two specific guests. Next to me is Ari. He is Chief Executive Officer of PLN Icon Plus. And next to Ari is my colleague, Anthony Gu, who is a consultant in the Electric Power Digitalization Business Unit in the consulting office. The journey of digital transformation is passing different stages. Uh, PLN is also going through these stages. Ari, in your experience, what exactly, or maybe what precise is the item of digital transformation uh, meaning to PLN? So PLN did digitalization along the whole business process of PLN. So we did digitalization from the primary energy, from the power plan, power generation, transmission, distribution, and also the customer's experience. We are also digitalization our supporting systems such as finance, human capital, and we do it at the same time. So the first phase of digitalization now is already completed. We simplify our business process to digitalization. So we now entering the new phase of digitalization. Now PLN, the CEO of PLN has declared that PLN now is not only the electricity company, but we are now also the technology company based on innovation. innovation. So innovation is very crucial here. We adopt the new technology to accelerate the digitalization. Thank you. That is quite impressive, actually. Anthony, from your experience in our consulting office, can you elaborate perhaps a little bit on how maybe in other scenarios, the benefit of digital transformation is also adding to more value in a wider scope? than just a technical advantage. Now uh, our customers and also Huawei is running very fast towards this direction. From generation to transformation and uh, distribution utilization. Now our power grid is emitting a very big challenge, especially from the new energy integration and also for the DRs like EV and solar. The digital technology should be uh, deeply integrated with our power grid and our energy technologies and uh, especially our AI, big data, and the blockchains will be widely used in the future, actually, especially in uh, substations and also for the power plants and also for distribution, especially in our campus and buildings, which we could help lower the carbon emission and also to improve the energy efficiency and also to improve the reliability and the security, especially for the power grid. And I think we could create more value, especially with our fast clients and partners, especially like PLN in the future to create more value for the industry together. Right now, we are here at Huawei Connect 2023. As you can see on the screen behind us, it says accelerate intelligence. It means we're speeding up. Where in PLN, where in your daily operations does AI play a role and how do you see the future of that? Adi. Okay, thanks. So PLN now entering the second phase of the transformation that focusing on the new technology, including big data, cybersecurity, and also AI. So AI, artificial intelligence, means for PLN is smart. So we make all of the digitalization that we have done before to make it smarter along the business process of PLN. One of the focus areas of making it smart is in the distribution and customer service. Of course, this also can cover all of the business process. For example, the PV rooftop generation can make the load balancing smarter. And also, the smart intelligence in AI implementation and customer experience can make customers of PLN more comfortable by the human-like interaction that they have now already filled before by the super apps of PLN. And that brings us to the end of this tech talk. Thank you for joining us. Thank you for watching.